Hello and welcome to Spotlight, a series where we catch up with our portfolio founders and find out what's exciting straight from them. Today, our guest is Kevin Hausberg, co-founder and CEO of Wagely. Welcome, Kevin. Thank you. Wagely uh, was started in 2020 and it's right. four years now. Tell me the inspiration behind setting up this organization and really a little bit of the journey the last four years. It all basically started with myself and um, Tobias, who's one of the co-founders, um, with us basically sitting down um, in, in Asia. Um, we've been working in, in Asia for about 10 years prior to starting Wagely, always been involved in financial industry and the financial services um, sector. And so what um, we stumbled upon really by chance was the earn wage access model that then essentially we, we piloted in Indonesia and, and, and since have grown um, pretty massively in both countries where we just saw an opportunity and we wanted to try it out. Um, we basically bootstrapped the the first six months, um, jumped into action, built a very small, very scrappy pilot, uh, partnered with a bunch of our friends that had smaller companies, uh, really ran trial and error, um, and uh, that's basically how the whole journey started. So Kevin, you've, you've identified a real problem and you've worked hard at you know, uh, creating a solution from grounds up, right? Mm. Uh, what has the last, what were the significant milestones of the last year? Over the last years, the, the, the significant milestones was really the, that first large public listed company partnering with Wagely and being that lighthouse for us. Um, and then from there, basically signing up um, the first thousand workers and having the first thousand uh, workers use our service, um, just continue to strengthen our, uh, you know, our commitment and, and our confidence in the model. And then, you know, it just steamrolled from there. The last year, the, the milestones have been incredible where um, we're now servicing more than 500,000 workers um, in, in Indonesia um, and Bangladesh and, and we're just continue growing very, very strongly. Fabulous. And another milestone is that you recently had a funding event. Um, what is the, the fresh capital infusion going to be put towards over the next year? Can you share a little bit about that, Kevin? The money that we've raised over the course of the last four years and especially the money that we've raised this year in the last funding round is being put to use to expand our reach. Um, Indonesia and Bangladesh, these are very, very populous countries. In total, there is a population of over 400 million people. Um, and we do not want to stop serving um, a half a million or a million of these, um, but really make an impact uh, in the workforces of these countries. So. Um, again, m most of the funding will be used to, to reach <clears throat> and service more and more employees. Um, the capital is pivotal for scaling uh, our operations and accelerating our growth and ultimately um, reach uh, sustainability, meaning that Wagely um, as an organization becomes um, profitable as well. Wagely is a very unique business um, and it's really uh, enabling financial wellness for employees in the regions you are in. Um, can you tell me a little more about the tangible impact that this is making for a lot of these employees through your e uh, earned wages access program? If the worker is experiencing a financial emergency, there's not a lot that the worker can do. Um, usually what happens is that the first thing that they do is they, they try to borrow funds from somewhere other than the traditional financial uh, sector or, or ecosystem, right? Which would be either the family, the friends, the employer, um, and at the worst from uh, a loan shark. So what Wagely is doing is really giving them 
a way out is giving them an alternative to access capital or funds that essentially is their own money that they have rightfully earned but not been paid yet. What it really does is give them a fair solution to access funds to bridge some of these emergencies. And with that obviously gives them tangible peace of mind, not having to worry about, you know, what is the next day going to look like. Fabulous. I think what you're doing, what you're building is wonderful, Kevin. I mean, to be able to make people enablers in solving their own financial problems is possibly one of the uh, best things one can do for many aspects of an individual's work life and their uh, personal lives. So more power to you, Kevin. Uh, thank you for joining us on Spotlight.